I'd like to introduce Helen Herbert. Helen is a... Um, she is the manager at the organisation, the Life, uh, Life Saving Society of South Africa, and she will be managing this wonderful event in 2019 in Durban. And to assist Helen, uh, Helen would like to invite all of the African delegates, the residents of Africa, they're going to help Helen sell to you the benefits of coming to Africa in 2019 for the World Conference. Welcome Helen and all of her friends. I too think of a few conferences ago, there was possibly one delegate from Africa. I think we've already come a long way. I don't think everybody who attended is actually on the stage, but thank you very much. So, if we can just go into the presentation. This is KwaZulu Natal, home of the Zulu Kingdom. <laughs> Capture the essence of the Zulu Kingdom from the warm waters of the Indian Ocean to the World Heritage Site of the mighty Drakensberg Escarpment. The ancient Zulus called this awesome place Ukathamba, Barrier of Spears. The Boer Fortrekkers called it Home of the Dragons. From here, you can survey the glorious realm of the legendary Zulu kings. Follow a tapestry of a thousand hills on an eagle's wings. Roam thrilling game parks. Relax your spirit on a meander through the gently rolling midlands. Explore the battlefields of Boer, British and Zulu. Negotiate the breathtakingly beautiful Isimangalese or Wetlands Marine Reserve, World Heritage Site, where turtles breed in November and give birth in January every year. The coast is a marine playground. Surf waves on boards and sea breezes. Follow leaping dolphin, dive with sharks, and experience the bubbling melting pot of exotic cultures that is the heartbeat of vibrant subtropical Durban. This is KwaZulu Natal, home of the Zulu Kingdom. of benefits for coming to South Africa. One dollar will give you 13 rand, um, which equates to, I think, four beers, maybe two. Um, one euro, 15 rand, you're getting closer to two and a half beers there. Um, and if we had to look at the Big Mac exchange rate, uh, a Big Mac is about 39 rand, 90, almost 40 rand and that equates to about $3 or €2.53. So you are welcome to bring your euros and dollars. We, would, we will spend them wisely, and I can guarantee you, you will get value for your investment. <laughs> Just to introduce you to our host hotel, we have contracted with the Tsoho Sun Group. They have various hotels along the greater Durban um, Golden Mile, all the way from five-star hotels in Umschlange all through to the Garden Court hotels uh, on adding, uh, close to the Addington Beach. Our main hotel will be the Elangeni Maharani, which is centrally situated to the left of the Elangeni. We have got one of our bigger life-saving clubs called Pirates. To the right of the Elangeni, we have the other one of our other larger life-saving clubs, which is Durban Surf, and about 
half a kilometer down the beachfront, we have the third largest of our life-saving clubs, which is Marine Life-Saving Club. The hotel is offering us very affordable rates, which we will make known to everybody very soon because they've given us an early bird rate, which, can, which will, will fall away at the end of March next year. And we will be offering secure transport to and from the various designated hotels. The Durban International Conference Center will be our host center for our meetings and our conference. And just so that you know, the date next year, book it now, 8th to the 10th of October, 2019. Just the next year, next conference. Um, the Durban ICC is one of the largest IC international conference centers in the world. It's definitely the most popular one in South Africa. It's just recently hosted the World AIDS Conference in which they had 15,000 plus delegates. We won't take up the whole center. I think we might have a corner of it. Uh, we're not quite at 15,000. Maybe we can get to 1,000. That would be wonderful. Um, there's lots of van uh, venues for plenaries and breakaway sessions. So if you need all your additional meetings, please bring them, bring your cohorts with you, and we can host any of your meetings that you wish to have. It's also located near the hotels and transport will be offered from the hotels to the venue. King Shaka International Airport is an airport with an international status and a number of our airline operators, uh, Qatar Airlines, Emirates, they fly directly into Durban. An approximate cost we, we looked at was about 750 euro if you're flying from Frankfurt to Durban, so it's fairly reasonably priced. And the travel from the airport to the city center where the hotel is and where the conference venue is takes about 30 minutes. There are airport shuttles and taxis and buses uh, that operate between the airport and the city center. How, and there are car rental facilities for those people who feel brave enough to drive on the left-hand side of the road. When you're in Durban, there's a, a uh, bus transport that runs every day, all day, from about half past four in the morning until about half past ten at night. And it's uh, titled the City Mover, or People Mover. And the cost is approximately one euro per day. Hop on, hop off, you can travel as much as you like. We also have contracted with a number of tour operators who will be available to take groups on tours around the city center, around the historical sites, and on various heritage tours. And please take, you make use of that, especially our natural wildlife. We would love to host you at various of our game parks in and around the KwaZulu-Natal and surrounding areas. We have launched already our website, wcdp2019.co.za. It has a countdown clock ticking. Twitter handles, at, WD, at, at WCDP2019. Facebook one coming soon, and our Instagram as well. They've already been booked, they're live, we can start posting. In Africa, there is a concept known as Ubuntu. Ubuntu is the sense that we are human only through the humanity of others. That if we are to accomplish anything in this world, it will in equal measure be due to the work and achievement of others. This is a statement made by our past president, Mr. Nelson Mandela. Ubuntu, we are a community. And within that community, we share our knowledge, and through the sharing of our knowledge, we will grow and develop better drowning prevention strategies across the world. 370,000 people die in drowning around the globe every year. That is 42 people every hour of every day of every year. This number could fill up stadiums for the world's biggest sporting events. For some, Drowning prevention starts with a family holiday to the beach. For most, 
It is an everyday danger. Scores of adults and children have to navigate their way through treacherous rivers each day in far-flung places around the world. As confirmed by the World Health Organization, 90% of drowning deaths happen in low- and middle-income countries. Their stories are barely heard. It is time to come to Africa and cast the spotlight on a public health threat that is too often neglected and underreported. Africa, the continent of majestic sunrises, glorious landscapes, a place where the spirit of Ubuntu is observed, and a place where centuries of exploitation and hardships have failed to break the African spirit. Yet the dangers are real, and education on issues like drowning prevention are more crucial than ever. Ubuntu, a quality that includes all the essential human virtues, compassion and humanity. Durban in South Africa looks forward to welcoming delegates to the 2019 International Life Saving Federation and World Health Organization's World Conference on Drowning Prevention. Durban is renowned for its golden beaches, warm climate and friendly people. Take in the sights and help make the next World Conference on Drowning Prevention a success for Africa and her people. South Africa is hosting it, but it is a conference dedicated to Africa. Ubuntu, growing global drowning prevention capacity. Thank you, everyone.